I, th I thought I'd found the trick to being able to drop Leo. You get him to have a mechanical at the very bottom. And I'm thinking, here we go. Here's the title of the vlog. How to drop Leo. And yet he comes back. Probably had like a two minute head start on him. So Jono's up from uh, Newcastle. Those people that did not get the John's Brothers reference in his uh, re-signing post, I mean, so fair enough, he wouldn't have a clue, but yeah, it's a pretty niche subject for you. But What are you copying at the moment? Left bar, four mint, and then I got two bottles of carrot. No, 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 no. Huh? What are you copying on your feet? Oh. Uh, <laughs> I'm in the hunt for our mum and yeah, Jordan and mum. Jono shares my passion slash obsession slash addiction to sneakers. In fact, I would suggest this man potentially has a worse case of it. Potentially, that's saying something. I reckon Leo, Leo could easily fall into the sneaker. Yeah. Just need to- I, I just love it. Yeah. Come on, you've got it in you, I know you do. I do, the parents pulled me off. <laughs> but now you're living away from them, they can't even yeah. see the purchases that you'd make. Cooper's another one, Cooper's definitely got it in him. He just needs- yeah, he just needs a little pushing. So boys, vote below. Jordan won Bordeaux for 2022. Should we ditch the race budget and just make it a sneaker budget? Yes. Yes, okay. Confirmed. Thank God we got rid of Jay. He would have left. <laughs> <laughs> What's coming up next week, man? Um, tour of Brisbane. No, try again. Um, tour of Sunshine Coast. Nope. There's something in Queensland. That's good. Four races over three days. Friday's a crit, Saturday is a road race, and individual time trial, and Sunday is a road race. It's a fourth NRS race of the year. Obviously, the last one, well, not obviously, but the last one was, believe it or not, Grafton, which happened back in May. And then we had a little, let's call it a hiatus. Yes, of a few months. So this is, yeah, you guys heard me talk about this a while back. Um, this race was set to start the day after Anastasia Pal Palaszczuk was to open the borders. We moved the border opening to earlier this week, and we're going. Uh, we're going, it sounds like there's about 90 starters, a good few interstate guys coming as well. So we're all in for it. We've got six guys racing. Look, this is this is a big deal for us because this is an NRS race. This is essentially what we do. It really ramps up from there because we go nationals in January, uh, festival cycling in Adelaide in January, then we go tour of Gippsland, then we go Warney. Next week is the start of it all. Really? Well, it's the big, it's funny because it's like it's the end of this season but it's the start of it. What are you looking forward to most next week? Ah, the crit. Um, in for a bunch gallop. Uh, if you live in Mwuba or that area, it's a evening crit, like 7.30 kickoff, mm. twilight. Get down there and watch Jono and a few Queenslanders have a skip around. What are we doing this afternoon? Abby's coming over. We got the tent out, the place set up as well. And we're having a Christmas party before Abby. There you go. To, um, <laughs> kitty shed, kitty shed, kitty shed, kitty shed. Strong, very strong. Kitty. Though I think, I think I can outdo her with my outfit. Yeah.
Mm. Marmalade, you're not welcome. Marmalade, this is what I think of marmalade. I don't like cats. <laughs> All right. We'll, uh, we'll see you over the next couple of days. But, yeah, Christmas party tonight. Today, today I should say. My light's back. <laughs> I went to get So Chris has gone to the toilet. Hey YouTube. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Just like the video. <laughs>